hello everyone how to solve this problem for the values of k if we have k plus 9 whole square is equals to 81 and we solve this problem for the values of k so here we solve this problem for two methods and i hope so you like both of these methods but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section so here uh, the very first thing uh, in first method is we are going to do is first we need to uh, remove this square sign so uh, there are three ways to remove this square sign uh, so first is we move this 81 in the left hand side uh, and it will be written as k plus 9 whole square and we move 81 it will become minus 81 is equals to 0 and now further in the next step we have this is k plus 9 whole square minus we write this 81 as 9 square and this whole equation equals to 0 and now here further in the next step we need uh, to uh, use here the nice algebraic formula you know that if we have a square minus b square is equals to a minus b times of a plus b so according to this uh, algebraic formula we write our above equation as in this form you see here the base of this term is our a and the base of this term is our b so first we have a minus b the value of a is k plus 9 minus b the value of b is 9 into a plus b so the value of a is k plus 9 and plus the value of b is 9 and this whole equation equals to 0 and now further in the next step we have you see here this is minus 9 and plus 9 are gone and we will get here k only and from here we get k plus this is 9 plus 9 becomes 18 and this whole equation equals to 0 so here we divide this equation into the two cases the first case is we write k equals to 0 and the second case is we write k plus 18 equals to 0 so uh, this is the our first real root of the given equation and from here we move this plus 18 to the right hand side and it will becomes minus 18 so this is the second root of the given equation uh, so there are uh, these are the two roots of the given equations which we get here from first method and now here uh, we move uh, forward and we again solve this problem for second method and i hope so you like both of these methods but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section uh, and now here in second method first we need to copy down the given question statement here it is k plus 9 square is equals to 81 so this is the our given question statement and now here further in the next step uh, here we just use here the nice algebraic formula you know about that if we have a plus b whole square is equals to a square plus 2 times of a b plus b square so according to this uh, nice formula we write here our above equation as uh, so here our a is k and b is 9 so according to this we write it as k square plus 2 times of k into 9 plus 9, b square so b is 9 square and we move this 81 in the left hand side and it will becomes minus 81 and this whole equation equals to 0 so here we need little bit simplifications and it will be written as k square plus this is 9 times of 2 becomes 18 k and plus this is 9 square equals to 81 minus this is also uh, 81 is equals to 0 and you see here this minus 81 and plus 81 are gone and we will get here k square plus 18k is equals to 0 and now here uh, you focus on both of these terms and you see here 
uh, on both of these terms uh, uh, both of these terms involve k this means that k be the common value so here we will take common k and after taking common k we get the remaining values are from here we get k and from here we get 18 and this whole equation equals to 0 and now further in the next step we need to break this value into the two cases uh, the first case is we write k is equals to 0 and the second case is we write k plus 18 equals to 0 so this is the our first real root of the given equation and now from here we get our k is equals to this is plus 18 when we move in the right hand side it will become minus 18 so this is the second value of k which we get here uh, from second method and you see here from both of these methods uh, we will get here uh, the same value of k and now further in the next step we need uh, to verify uh, these two values of k and here we check that uh, is these two values of k is satisfied or verify our given question statement or not so for this we need to copy down given question statement here it is k plus 9 whole square is equals to 81 so this is the given question statement and now here uh, in this side we check the value of k equals to 0 and uh, here we check the value of k is equals to minus 18 so we divide uh, this verification uh, into the two parts and we check both of these parts simultaneously and uh, now here first we need to verify k equals to 0 for this we put this k equals to 0 uh, into the left hand side and it will be written as 0 plus 9 whole square is equals to 81 this is our claim we check that is this equals to 81 or not and we know that uh, 0 plus 9 is equals to 9 square equals 81 and you clearly see that 9 square equals to 81 equals to 81 so this shows that the value of k equals to 0 is satisfied over given question statement and now here uh, in the next step we put the value of k equals to minus 18 in the left hand side and it will be written as this is uh, minus 18 plus 9 whole square is equals to 81 and now minus 18 plus 9 is equals to minus 9 square is equals to 81 we know that minus 9 square becomes plus 81 equals to 81 this shows that the second value of k is also satisfied our given question statement so finally we have these are the two solutions of the given question this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos